You don't know the house when you, you won't know the house when you come home. We've moved. <laughs> <laughs> About your father. He's got a lovely new job. He has five hundred men under him. He cuts grass at the cemetery. <laughs> your sister. They had a baby this morning. I haven't found out about whether it's a boy or a girl, as I don't know if you're an aunt or an uncle. <laughs> I went to the doctor's on Thursday, and your father came with me. The doctor put a small tube in my mouth and told me not to talk for ten minutes. Your father offered to buy it from him. <laughs> your uncle Patrick drowned, drowned last week in a sort of in a, in a vat of Irish whiskey at, at the Dublin Brewery. Some, some of his workmates tried to save him, but he fought them off bravely. <laughs> <laughs> they cremated him. It took two days to put the fire out. <laughs> it, it, only, it only rains twice this week, first for three days, then for four days. We had a letter from the undertaker. He said, if the last payments on your grandmother's plot wasn't paid in seven days, up she comes. <laughs> your, your loving mother. But yes. I was going to send you five pounds, but I've already sealed the envelope. <laughs> 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 <laughs>